Hello, my name is Render, and I'd like to talk to you about some today. Well, some time ago I was watching an interview by Kid Riot, where he was talking with uh, a few high-level players about what was and wasn't really important in adventure gameplay. And I remember that, for a moment, the conversation turned to flash suppressors. Now, the overall tone was that, that they weren't really important, which I agree with. But one of the reasons why, in their opinion, flash suppressors were sidelined was because you never identify or notice the target by the flash their guns produce. So in that moment, I'm like, what the fuck? Not only is that statement counterintuitive, but also it excludes you from, you know, the majority of the fauna of planet Earth. There is a reason why motion is the easiest thing to perceive, because it is the sudden change of light. This is how, in a nutshell, our vision of course works. This extends into the game. We could argue that in planet side there are many things that help us, you know, like cue spotting, sensors, Doritos, and the minimap in general. But it doesn't change the fact that when you stand out, you stand out. I mean, just look at this video and notice how much easier it is to see people when they shoot or I shoot them, or when heavies turn on their shield. I seriously have no freaking clue where this brick of knowledge came from that visibility is not important. Now just try to tell me that this guy was visible because of his silhouette, not because of the muzzle flash. I mean, of course you have the minimap, and of course you make sound, but it matters whether people can see you. There is a reason why we turn off the heavy shield when we are in the smoke. There is a reason why we don't use the shiny, glowy anniversary armor even though it's nice. And there is a reason I saw that guy. I mean, if this wasn't a thing, I wouldn't be able to play Planetside nowadays. I don't have a GPU and I'm running on my laptop with 50% render quality. All the footage that you are actually seeing nowadays is something I took long time ago and I'm trying to use nowadays just to fill in the gap before I get my GPU back. Okay, so now that we have established this, let's imagine what one can do not only not to stand out from his environment, but also not to stand out from the rest of his teammates. So like we talked about, you can use the flash suppressor or the standard suppressor. You can use standard armor and the standard helmet without having, you know, any shiny bits and pieces on it. You can go as far as using only the standard camo so that other people don't pick you out. You should also remember to turn off your shield when you're a heavy and to turn off your medical uh, ability when you're, let's say, in the smoke or in an open area at night. Some people even go as far as trying to mimic how the other empires look. What I mean by that is they use the right camo and the right emblems to, to make them look like TR or NC, while in the reality they are VS. Now, you've probably noticed this, that some VS look, t look like TR and some VS look like NC. I'm not really a big fan of this trick, but it is legit. Honestly, it is legit. But personally, I don't use it. Anyway, no matter what you choose, remember that Visibility matters. Thanks a lot for watching, and I hope to see you both on stream and in game. Renzer out.